Why media did not report this? Huge protests all over Europe last weekend. People in France want to get out of NATO. People in Germany demand to stop funding Ukraine immediately. People in the Netherlands want to stop globalist agenda. Here are the challenges that European countries facing. In Czech Republic, a massive demonstration in Prague against the government, soaring prices and the energy crisis. The protesters just sent a clear message to their government. There will be tough action if government doesn't resign by September 25th. In France, 10,000 people took the streets of Paris and made a clear demand. Let's get down NATO. French people have had enough of globalist agenda. They don't want the soaring energy prices and inflation anymore. In the Netherlands, thousands of people gather in Amsterdam. They stand firmly with their farmers against the ruler government and the World Economic Forum agenda. During the protests, undercover police were trying to arrest the Dutch farmers and peaceful protesters. But a lot of Dutch citizens showing big support for the farmers and asking the government to let them alone. At the same time, the Dutch farmers continue making their voices heard by hanging huge upside-down flags on our country. And by keep doing this, in the end, we the people will decide. In Italy, more and more people came out and burned their energy bills. Few days ago, only people in Naples City dared to come out. Now it has become a movement. People in Terni, Assisi, Bastia, Forino, Gabbio, Norcio, Spoleto, and many other cities are burning their energy bills with a message. We don't pay, now that's enough. In Germany, protests are everywhere to demand the lifting of sanctions against Russia and stop funding Ukraine immediately. The corrupt politician in German government pushed the whole Germany country into the situation of dependence on Russian energy. And now the working people will be affected the most in the coming winter. Corrupt politicians are always rich, they will never be affected. Unfortunately, these demonstrations are censored by European media. While protests happen all over Europe, the mainstream media still stays silent. Thank you so much for watching and see you later.